weather could play spoil sport during the upcoming Labor Day Golden Week. And a bit to lure travelers from across the border during the long holiday on the mainland, the Tourism Board has planned a 10-minute fireworks show at Victoria Harbour on May 1st. It is the first of a series of pyrotechnic displays which the government plans to hold on a monthly basis going forward. According to the observatory's forecast, the weather on Labor Day is expected to be cloudy with showers and squally thunderstorms. Tourism chief Kevin Young earlier said crowds should be prepared for a possible cancellation and a decision would be made by Wednesday afternoon if the display will be affected. Sarah Lung, who chairs the Federation of Hong Kong Trade Unions in Tourism, believes calling off the event would not cause a major impact to travelers. This is because fireworks shows are very common in first and second tier cities on the mainland. Taking to the airwaves this morning, Travel Industry Council Chairwoman Gianna Xu reviewed that the city is expecting 800 mainland tours during the holiday. The figure has almost returned to pre-pandemic levels. Most of the tours are spending two nights in the city, and only a single-digit percentage of groups opted for a three-night stay. Meanwhile, an art installation featuring hundreds of glowing egg-shaped objects on display at Tema Park were deflated due to unstable weather. But only exhibits measuring 5 meters in height and in windy areas were affected. This traveler from Zhejiang was not disappointed of the arrangement, saying it was understandable. The Leisure and Cultural Services Department will consider blowing up the installations once the weather turns stable. Janice Lowe, Cable News.